Is there, there's a hiding, okay, cool. oh my gosh. I got so scared that there wouldn't be any hiding spots. Oh! Good morning, everybody. Brevinini here, and welcome to a game called Midnight Made Night. So this is from the same developer that made The Man From The Window, The Shadow Catcher, and a bunch of other games that I played from them because I'm a fan of them and I know you guys are a fan of them too. They just came up with a new game, so let's just go ahead and get into this. Let's see what we're getting ourselves into. <laughs> As a maid, Nina, my services, hey. Loki looks like me. Oh, just kidding. Naomi! I actually really love the name Naomi. Okay, but really, it makes sense. First, you replace a single plank on the ship, then another. What are you talking about? And you keep going until everything has been replaced and nothing from the original ship is left. Then you ask, is it still the same ship? And if not, when did it stop being this what are we talking about why are we talking about these philosophical like what off the bat oh what <laughs> i mean <laughs> i don't know this is just crazy we started with like a normal human i'm like okay this is gonna be a human universe nice and then we jump to like a straight bug wouldn't it be easier to build a new ship instead of going through all that Ruth, that's not the important part. It's a thought experiment. Well, if you ask me, Theseus needs to quit thinking so much and go stop his ship from being dismantled. <laughs> Maybe that's the point of all this. Don't get distracted by silly little details when someone's out to get you. Oh my gosh. I don't, I think we're getting off track here. Oh, hold on, my phone's going off. Uh, shoot, what's wrong? Our two o'clock just canceled on us. Uh-oh. Why's that? I'll read her message for you. Okay, so, gotta cancel the appointment. Owner found out and isn't happy. Says she's rather cleaned the place herself. Oh, they don't need us? We're like the best cleaning company ever. And that's our last appointment for the month too. There is one more we could do. No, we're not doing that. <laughs> well, we have to do something here. If I miss one more payment, they're gonna take the van. Then that's the end of the midnight maids. Oh, snap. Oh no, and I don't think either of us wants to start looking for a new career at this point. Ruth, you're killing me, I swear. Oh, come on now. We don't even have to clean the place. We just have to move a few boxes, drop them off afterwards. We'll be in and out before you know it. Hmm, let's go. That's the Naomi I know. We'll be there in no time. Let's go, Hey! And also I noticed Naomi's like fingers. They were not human-like, so I don't know what Naomi is. She's not human. Oh my gosh, okay, nice, but we are maids and we, oh yeah, yeah, there you go. See, the whole body, the whole body makes sense now. I'm already getting bad vibes about this place, man. I'm not too thrilled about it either, but the sooner we get there, but the sooner, what is Naomi, is Naomi a bird? Okay. But the sooner we get started, the sooner we can get out of here. I know, I know. It's just, what? Are they shady? They're the little shady people? You don't want to deal with them? I understand that. All right, what's first on the agenda? I'll check. Mm. Uh, the East State have been sold and the previous owner's possessions are being auctioned off tomorrow. We hired some movers, but they unexpectedly left a few hours into the work and hasn't replied back yet. The previous owner is currently unavailable, so I need you to finish up the job. All you need to do is pick up whatever items are still left and drop it all off at my place. You have more empty boxes than you'll need to use. You may put any unexpected ones back on the bench. Sounds easy enough. You send them a message and let them know we're here. I'll start packing up in here first. Okay, so is it really that easy you just go like, <laughs> okay, so we gotta go pick up some boxes. How much can we pick up? We got to pick up. Okay, okay, I don't know how much I just grabbed. And then we have the go and um, I already forgot what they said. I think we had to, oh, not this way. <laughs> I literally already forgot. Hey, Naomi, yeah? Why is there a pile of doors here? <laughs> I think I read something about the o new owner being allergic to bronze. I thought they were gonna say allergic to doors. Like that's why they had all the doors taken off or something. A bronze allergy, how strange. Okay. Naomi, I already forgot what I'm supposed to do. By the way, they sent some instructions for this room. Pack up the books, pack up the old letters, pack up all the papers. 
There are more instructions for the rooms here. Just talk to me if you want. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So Naomi is our person. So we gotta just go pack up all the papers. This should be easy. This should be easy. Too easy. Come on, Naomi. This we should have took this job ages ago. This is perfect. Let's go. Did I run out of boxes? I don't even know. I'm just gonna keep clicking until I run out of boxes. Because <laughs> I don't know how many boxes I picked up. <laughs> I just I'm just filled with boxes right now. A oh yeah, Ruth. I think Ruth has like four arms. So it makes sense. I think I pick up four boxes. Nice. Too good. Literally too good. Look, it's, the place is clean. Spotless. Oh, just kidding. Spotless. Let's go. Call me up. Best maid ever, Nina 2022. Let's go. There we go. That's the room taken care of now. I better go ahead and take this box out to the van. Be right back. Sure thing. Okay, cool. So when you're done with the boxes, you gotta go and take it out to the van. Nice. This is nice, easy work. Oh, that was just one box. These boxes aren't full. Wow, all those paper and boxes, books just fill up one? Oh, hi! You look like the guy from the other one, like the curse. Oh, hey Ruth. You didn't tell me that the old home owner would be here. He's not supposed to. Oh, I'm scared, actually. Scared me almost half to death when he showed up. Terribly sorry about the fright, madam. Though I do have a question. I feel I must ask. Your attire suggests you're here for work. Please tell me, has something happened? My friend and I were contracted to move things out before the new owner shows up. New owner? So we finally lost the estate then. Oh, is that him? Is that his father or something? Is this connected? I should have known. But never mind that. I must suggest you to return in the morning. Things tend to go very, very strange in this house at this late hour. Tomorrow? I can't do daylight. And I'm nocturnal. Oh, so we only work at night. Besides, if we don't finish this job tonight, we don't get paid. I see, I see. Well, we can't have that. In that case, you'll need to keep a close eye out for my father doing your work. <laughs> what? 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 The man had this fair share of demons in life. In his current state, he's only gotten worse. So this, this might be connected. This actually might be connected. But don't worry. Lights in this mansion tend to react to the energy he gives off. Should they begin to glow blue, then you know that he's on his way. I'm sure you'll like to know what you should do at that point, right? Well, a family such as ours had had its share of enemies. Because of this, every room in this mansion has a secret code that can be used to hide inside. My father has long since lost the presence of mind to check these hiding spots, so you should be safe therein. I wish I could tell you that he's not as bad as he seems, but he is. So, it's best that you just avoid him outright. I'll leave you both to get back to your work. Just pretend I'm not even here. I'll like for the record to show that I'm not okay with any of this. <laughs> I'm Naomi right now. Like, I would like to say that I'm not okay. Naomi, hush. We'll be fine. Thank you for your help, sir. We appreciate and he's gone. Okay. So when it turns blue, we gotta go and hide. I like how she's just our flashlight right now. Okay, so cool. So we got four boxes, and we got Ruth behind us. So what's the next spot, Ruth? Uh-huh. Check time? It's 2.03. The new homeowner's supposed to get here at Oh, we gotta finish before six! Oh, if we still want to get paid, that is. Okay, interesting. Okay, so let's go. Um, I'm kind of scared. I, I know that he's coming at blue. Oh. Oh, hey! What's up, my guy? <laughs> One would not be able to tell it now, but our dining room used to be quite the grandest sight. All manners of patients have graced this room. Though, I sometimes wonder if they still would have visited had they known what truly went on here. What went on here? W were they eating people? Well, what? And are you gonna leave? Oh my gosh. Okay, what are we supposed to do? All the, the, the dishes? Yeah. Check the room status. The message says, pack up the table placements. Pack up the go trays. There's still more stuff to grab here, Ruth. I know! Okay, cool. But that should be easy. So we just gotta kind of pay attention to those lights. I wonder if there's also gonna be sound effects or it's just gonna be like, uh, <laughs> you just have to keep looking at it. Um, I guess only one way to find out. Once it happens, we'll know. I'm gonna keep looking at the lights. I'm so scared that it's gonna turn blue. 
What I'm not even noticing. Okay. Come on, pack it up, pack it up. Okay. Oh, it's blue, it's blue. Oh, it's blue. So how long do we have? Is Naomi here with me? Nice, let's go. Okay, so you don't even tell you. You don't even hear it. Oh, wow, you don't even hear it. They just turn on you. Okay, cool. Good job, Naomi. Good job. We did it. Okay. Okay, so literally you don't even hear it. That's crazy. Why is Naomi not helping me? Like, I know you're like the person, the brains behind this situation. I'm the bronze. But like, we could get this done so much easier if you... Is, is this it? Is that it? Oh, no, I can't talk to you. I can't talk. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Let's hide, let's hide, let's hide. Oh, get in, get in. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That was so freaking nerve-wracking because I asked her as soon as I was... My gosh, man. The guy must be noticing something, though. He must be like, uh, um, where is all my stuff going? <laughs> okay, Naomi, I gotta talk to you. What's up? Okay, check the room status. That's it for the room. We got everything. Coolio, let's go. This is already freaking nerve wracking. <laughs> okay. Oh, I got three boxes. Okay, Naomi, let's go. We have a couple more, um, a couple more rooms. Oh my gosh. Free? Oh, really? <laughs> you both seem to be quite adept at this. That other group of movers had already turned tail and run by now. Cleaning houses is usually our specialty, but sometimes we have to take other jobs as well. And then I get dragged into some insane situation just because we need the money. Like now. Like last month, when we almost got buried alive in the church's basement. How does one end up in a predicament like that? Yeah, good question. Good, good question, because maybe it's because someone accepted <laughs> without reading the entire job description. Ruth, it said groundbreaking birth, didn't it? How was I supposed to know? Do you see what I have to go through? <laughs> my, my, you two sure are something else. I wish you had more help like you during my time. And where are my manners? I never introduced myself. My name is Joseph. Joseph Vermander! Oh, it is a Vermander! Okay, yeah, this is connected. If you guys don't know, check out the other gameplay of the Vermander curse. This is connected. I love that. That's awesome. I'm Naomi. She's Ruth. It's an honor to meet you both. I don't mean to delay you, really. It's just nice to finally have someone to talk to after all this time. I'll let you return to your work. Okay, Joseph. Nice to meet you, too. Okay, um, hope, I mean, it would be better if, like, you could call your, your, your father off. Is this another room? Oh. <laughs> Why do you keep doing this? Why? <laughs> Many a thanks meal has been prepared in this room. Well, I, of course, did my job to respect help. Father wasn't always so accommodating. God forbid you incorrectly cooked a meal on one of his bad days. The ashes contained in that oven aren't just from the wood, you know. Okay. Wow, it's from people too? Okay, so, oh my gosh. So let's go. We got more boxes. Why is there just boxes in here? What if we're in the front? What if we're outside when it turns blue? I wonder. Okay, so that's two rooms down. I don't know how much more to go. Oh, it turned blue. Get in. Come on, Naomi, come in here. <laughs> oh. That's creepy. This place is huge. I mean, this is a mansion. I have to try not to get lost, <laughs> but let's go. I think that's the best strat. We just gotta go work room by room and we'll be we'll be done in no time. This is, uh, this is easy. Oh, wait, no, no, don't add on any difficulty. It's getting rather late, which means I should probably tell you about Cornelius. Who's that? Who? <laughs> A long time ago, he used to be one of my father's servants, a true paragon of a butler. I haven't one bad word to say of the man. But one cold January morning, a terrible blizzard arrived, and you and I both know how rare snow is here. The entire town was shut down. Our family had absolutely everything one might need in an emergency. Food, water, and even firewood to last for days. However, father wasn't happy for the man was accustomed to reading his newspaper every morning. Given the conditions outside, the paper obviously could not be delivered that day. But instead of occupying his time doing something else as the same person would, 
He sent poor old Cornelius out to retrieve the morning. Wow! Father didn't even have the decency to give the man a winter coat to you. They just sent him out bare? He just sent him out wholly unprepared. <laughs> Suffice to say, Cornelius didn't return. The man met his untimely demise out there in all the ice and snow. And now something appears outside every night, just past the gate. Something that used to be Cornelius. I do not know what happened to him out there in that blizzard, nor do I know what he wants. But when you venture outside, be sure not to stay out for there for too long. Otherwise, you may very well end face to face with him. Oh my god, now they're making it unsafe to go outside! Ah! <laughs> Freak! They added on to the difficulty, guys. They added on to it. Freak! <laughs> I thought it was too good to be true. Like, too easy. I knew it was like, oh, this is way too easy. That's creepy. That creeped me out. Hey, look at me. Look how jacked I am. Hey, okay, so this room, do we just gotta pick up boxes again? Oh my gosh. Like, I'm running out of arms for this. Uh, the message said, pack up all the towels and take the boxes out. Okay, at least we can get the, the towels now. Because I already have two boxes in my hand. It's like, it should be turning blue any moment now. Is it not going to turn blue? Oh, it's turning blue. There you go. That's what I was waiting for. I knew it. I knew it was going to turn blue. So let's go ahead. Hide away. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, this is just getting more and more stressful. Not going to lie, guys. Let's go. We got this. Oh! Is that what he looks like? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. He looked creepy. He was, like, all big and buff. Oh, my gosh. This place is such a maze. Is he gonna be out there? Like, I'm just gonna- I'm gonna be fast, okay? Come on, let's go! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh my gosh. I'm so afraid of staying out there for too long. Like... It sounded like there was something. Okay, let's continue. Is he gonna stop? Oh my gosh! He's gonna add something else! I have one final thing to tell you both. I'd rather keep this particular story to myself, but for your own safety, I must tell you of- Agatha! <laughs> Who's Agatha? Agatha used to be part of the help. Like Cornelius, she too was an exemplary servant. Throughout her time here, both she and I grew close. Very close. Despite knowing full well the impact it would have on my family's social status, I asked her to marry me. Oh, that type of close. I get it. She and I then planned to elope and run away together. I didn't care that I was giving up my inheritance by doing so. I only wanted us to be together. But the night before we were to make our escape from this awful place, father find out. Again and again I asked him, where is she? And what have you done? He eventually answered me, though sometimes I wish that he didn't. He told me that she was under the floorboard where she belongs. Then he went on about his day reading his newspaper and having his breakfast like nothing happened. He, he buried her under the house? Agatha didn't deserve to end up like this. She'll probably wake up soon. Should you see the candle suddenly go out, you know she's in the same room as you. You know, I still try to talk to her, but she never responds. I don't think she recognizes me anymore. She just runs away if I ever look at her. Okay, so if she's in the same room, I gotta run. I, I gotta look at her. I gotta look at her. <sighs> okay. How much more rooms do I have? I think I- What is this?! What is that? We gotta hide. Oh my gosh. What the freak is this room? Who's over here doing? What is this room? Oh my god. This is ridiculous. No, this is right. Who bought this house? Like, who said? Who came in this house and said, ah, uh, just need a little shining. I can fix this place up. Just need a little fixer upper. It's fine. Wow. Okay, so what, what do we need to pick up here? Um, that's strange. Nothing in the message written about this room. We better grab what we can just to be sure why would we even what are we even grabbing here the skulls why i don't even know why we did all that why did we grab all that that made no sense i think that's it let's get out of here i don't like this room. i don't like this room either i think for this place we just gotta get all the boxes so let me go and um go to a place that i don't need to get oh was that Agatha? That was freaking... I, the light didn't even go out yet. Where? Agatha! I see you! I see you, Agatha! <laughs> oh my gosh. That's one good thing. You can actually hear Agatha. 
Like you can hear like a noise sound effect. A attic. There was only boxes. Oh, that's the thing. I can't. Oh, there's just a bunch of boxes. Uh, <laughs> I am like literally all my arms are full. It's just a bunch of boxes. Are these just a bunch of bedrooms? Oh my god. Oh, what's up, my guy? This mansion has been in our family for generations, you know. After my father finally met his end, everything went to me. So your father is dead. So what is he doing here? During my time, I tried my best to correct the past sins of my family. The hope were treated fairly for once. I lowered the prices on all of our properties. I even tried returning all those liberated artifacts we used to keep down in the basement. I was well on my way to pulling our family's name out of the mud, you know. But then somehow father became so enraged by my actions that he brought himself back from the dead to stop me. To be honest with you, I wasn't even that surprised. He broke just about every law he could while he's still alive. Breaking universal laws were the next logical step. Wow. Where is she? Where is she? What's up, Hagatha? <laughs> She's so creepy. So, my gosh, like, the only thing that sucks is I have, I have too many boxes on me. And now I just have to literally go through here and just collect a bunch of boxes that I don't have, I don't have arms for. That's the only bad thing about this. <laughs> Naomi, why are you not helping me? Is there anything else? I oh gosh, you creep. Oh my gosh. Okay, I wonder if there's anything else I gotta pick up. I don't think so. Oh man, she is such a freaking creep. I think I got everything from these rooms. Oh man, I'm literally stuck with these boxes. Actually, can I? Oh, I feel stupid. I forgot. That's the first thing they said. They said that if you, oh, we gotta go, we gotta go. Come on. If you don't need the boxes, then I, I have an extra box. I don't. Oh, oh, I see you. Come on, we gotta go. Hide, hide, hide. Oh my gosh. But I remember. I forgot. Oh my gosh. I'm so stupid, guys. I'm literally like. 50% stupid guys. Okay, so let's see how much time. I hope I didn't waste too much time doing that. What? I didn't come in here? But this is where I need boxes! Oh my god. A vast selection of tomes and books used to be housed in the room. We collected it all over generations, so much knowledge, yet somehow despite all that, we still weren't clever enough to save ourselves. Wow, I am legit stupid guys. Like, legit? Like, as soon as I dropped off my boxes, that's what I need, the boxes? <laughs> oh my gosh. I have to hurry up and go outside and go quickly back in. Come on, come on, get in, get in. Like, you can literally hear his footsteps. Okay, we're gonna take some, ooh, Agatha, what's up? <laughs> so now let's come back and collect these books. Oh man, I can't believe I was literally, <laughs> oh, I could have used those books. There's those things for that. Naomi, get out the way! Naomi, get out the way! Literally busting my butt out here. My Naomi, she has it nice, doesn't she? Okay. Um. Ooh, this turned blue. Let's get in. Okay, so library complete. Another room complete. I, I gotta check the time to see how... Because I know that we only have until 6 a.m. I feel like I've been running around here with my box situation for too long. Um, check the room. That's it for the room. We got everything. And what time is it? It's 501. We only have an hour left. Oh yeah, that's not good. Oh gosh, guys, we have to hurry up. We have to hurry up. We only literally have an hour left. That's not good. Ooh, this is getting down to the wire, guys. Oh, is there? There's hiding. Okay. Oh my gosh, I got so scared that there wouldn't be any hiding spots. Oh. Is she gonna kill us? Is she gonna kill us? She better not. 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 My heart literally skipped a beat when I saw her there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I really thought she was gonna kill us. Like she's like, she was looking at us like, why are you hiding from me? Okay, good. We're out. Is that all, though? I feel like there was... Ooh, where is she? Hey! What's up, Agatha? Creep. Was that everything? Are we still missing a room? Okay! Let's go! Let's go! Yeah? No? 
The duo had worked throughout the night right up until the last moment. Nice! Wait, was this signal? Is However, they were unable to meet their agreement? Was I not? I thought I got everything! Angry that the mansion was in the previous promise condition, the pair left leaving the... What? They were not paid for their efforts. See guys, I told you they were gonna be like, yeah, you're not, you're not done, you're not done, so you get no money. Though they left the mansion unscathed, they were unable to find more work before the month end in the night. What? Having no way to continue their work, the two way parted ways. They both eventually landed new dead end jobs to make ends meet. Despite the inherent danger of being in the midnight maids, they both truly missed their work together. What? I thought I was finished. I thought that was it. What? I'm mad. I'm mad. Oh my gosh. Let's go back again. I'm mad. I did. I, I thought I was finished. Literally, I thought I was finished. But no. No, they really said. Oh, what? What was I missing? Okay, so I think one thing I missed in the last run was that this is actually all the rooms and they tell you whatever circled it it tells you basically what you need to do okay so i didn't i didn't know that i didn't know that. <laughs> um so i think i did miss a room come on man make your appearance and leave i gotta speed run this man that's crazy okay so i believe i only have two more rooms or one more room left either one or two this room and either another room or this is the last room i can't remember but or let's go i think we're making really good time right now what time is it what's my final score 445 see guys i was making good progress let's go let's go is that it let's go Eight? Let's go! That was it. Oh my gosh. I can't believe, I really feel like I got everything. But I guess I wasn't, I don't know. I must have missed one thing. That's crazy. Okay, leaving already? Yep, we're all done here. Thankfully. No offense, my guy, but your house creeps me out. <laughs> I suppose you're right about that. This place does give off quite the oppressive atmosphere. Still, I'm going to miss it. This is the only place I've ever known, you know? But it's high time for me to move on. There's no point in haunting this place. So he is a ghost! <laughs> a moment longer for our time here is over. I have to thank you both for helping me realize that. Without you here, I suppose I never would have talked myself through my own issues. You're very welcome, dear. <laughs> Honestly, this is nothing new for us. We usually just take tack on another 50 bucks to the bill when we help someone's spirit move on. <laughs> So this is literally just the norm for them. Just the everyday. Oh, we're we've been talking to a spirit this whole time. Sounds about right. <laughs> I'll expect nothing else from the midnight maids, I suppose. It's been fun. Goodbye, my friends. Where do you think you're? Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> do do you want our help too? We can help you get to the afterlife as well, Jeremiah. You're not going anywhere, boy. You know what, father? No, I'm done with you. My whole life has been, has revolved around you. I spent the entirety of my youth trying my best to please you, yet you only thought of yourself. And I spent the rest of my short time here trying in vain to atone for your evil deeds. I refuse to let you ruin my life. afterlife as well. That's it. Wow. Oh, Agatha, you guys can be together now, right? It sure took you long enough to come around, Joey. Agatha? You you still remember me? Why haven't you said anything until now? I was waiting for you to finally stand up to your big oaf. I thought giving you the silent treatment for a while might help you figure it out, but no! So I decided to continue to ignore you and run away! Well, better late than never, I suppose. Exactly! Now come on, let's finally leave this place behind! Together! Yes, we must depart at once. You wouldn't dare! What a bad old man. <laughs> and they take their hand. Oh, and they're free. Oh, this is a happy ending. This is a great ending. Oh, look at this man. He's salty. He's bitter. He's forever alone. This is your fault. If you didn't listen to him ramble on, he'll still be here with me. You're going to pay for that. What you going to do about it, huh? Oh, 
Oh, is that the guy? Let's go! Hey, Cornelius! Oh, there you are, sir. Here's the newspaper you wanted. This whole time, he just wanted to give him the newspaper? I asked for this paper years ago, you useless idiot. Not even a thank you, huh? Yeah, yeah, give him a punch or something. I don't know. Cornelius, you're too good. Well, that's quite all right, sir. I brought you something else as well. Would you like to know the weather forecast? What? The weather forecast, sir. There's a heat wave coming. I thought you should know. Uh, you're burning! <laughs> huh? What is this? No, I will not go yet. My legacy, I must preserve it. Oh, that's what you get, man. Like, literally, Cornelius was like, here's your newspaper, sir. He was still being such a freaking good guy. You really said, nah, nah, that's been too long. Right, oh, now that's finally sorted. I better take my leave as well. Stay safe out there. What a happy ending. Awesome. Never a dull moment, huh? Not by a long shot, my dear. Not by a long shot. <laughs> yeah. And they're, like, used to it, though. They're very used to it. They're just like, ah. Just another day in the midnight maid services. <laughs> and just like that. Is that how it ends? Yeah, that's the end. And do I get a star? I got a star. <laughs> I feel so accomplished now. Let's go. I'm happy. These, these games always have, like, a happy ending at the end, which I'm so freaking happy about. But I finally did it. Let's go. Definitely let me know what you guys thought about this game down below in the comments. But as for me, that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like down below. And if you see more from me, feel free to join my channel and hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you in my next video. Nina. Ow.